Good morning, Fabian Garcia, DPT here. And uh, today, Tuesday, January 12, 2016, what I want to go over was the magnet therapy that we do for patients here at the clinic. The main concept with the magnet therapy that we have is that we want to actually manipulate the pH of a tissue. A lot of the problems that therapists and physical therapy has in general is that we do not address the quality of a tissue. All we really assess is a range of motion stretching soft tissue work to increase the range of motion, range of motion, range of motion. That's not enough, that's not close to enough. What we really need to do is change the quality of the tissue. I use the analogy that if you go to an Argentinian steakhouse, order a skirt steak, it's well done, you ask for it rare. Send it back to the kitchen, they just cut it in half and give you double the thing. Well, that's pretty much what a lot of soft tissue work is out there. What they did was that they increased the range of the motion numerically. In other words, you doubled the length of the tissue, but you did nothing to address the quality of the tissue. And that's a huge issue because now you have two feet of steak that is not the quality that you wanted. I asked for the rare one and said I got two feet now of well done. That's the analogy I often use with patients to describe this. So what we do is that we use magnet therapy with Hachi magnets, Fixed North Pole magnets. This is forged lead that's been magnetized. So these are fixed pole magnets. These are positive magnets, negative magnets attached to micro cups. And we also employ magnets within the pads as well. So this one has 16, this one has 24, this one has 60. Now, the reason that we employ so much magnet therapy with every single patient as the first thing that's done is because we need to address the quality of the tissue. Again, quality of the tissue is really the essence of what we do here that's very different and very unique, honestly, to every clinic in the United States. The quality of tissue is that anytime that you have a pathological tissue, it is a tissue that is in an acidic state. Pathology, inflammation, in any way that it comes manifested, whether it's a tendonitis, bursitis, a colitis, cancer, a flu, I don't care what it is. Pathology can only exist in an acidic state. Again, pathology can only exist in an acidic state. So what do we do? We gain a quality edge on, our, on the tissue that we're trying to address by actually placing magnets that have three inches of penetration so we can be very specific with its application and then we create what we call here a magnet sandwich where we put this block that has three feet of penetration. So this injured tissue that I have, as you can see, it's a little bit beat up. This injured tissue is now in a completely magnetic field in which I have two to three inches of penetration going down, three feet coming up. My pathological tissue is completely enveloped in the magnetic field, in a positive magnetic field, which will transform my acidic tissue, which is causing me discomfort, into an alkaline tissue, which is now ready to accept oxygen. Well, what does that mean? Well, oxygen is really what we want to deliver to the tissue to, de uh, to deliver nutrients. So a tissue without oxygen is a very damaged tissue. So this gives us a huge edge because now we can take this acidic tissue, make it alkaline or close to alkaline, and then we can start doing our manipulations, our negative pressure, whatever it is that the therapist feels like doing for that for that patient at that time. The other thing that we can also do is when patients lay down, we can put them on these mattress pads as well. So for example, if someone is coming in with more of a lumbago, a global back pain, we can throw two pads with 60 magnets inside here, and they're nickel sized magnets. That's 120 magnets on which a patient will lie down on, what that's gonna do is downregulate the central nervous system. Within five to 10 minutes, you're gonna be out cold snoring. They're gonna come in with global pain, could be completely out. Why? Two things, we're calming down the central nervous system because again, magnetic fields affect electrical fields. What's the central nervous system? A huge electrical field. Downregulates it and also addresses those tight paraspinals, which aren't letting the thoracic outlet or lumbar outlet do its thing. So in essence, what a lot of patients get is the real treatment of having tissues treated with magnet therapy, every single patient across the board, no exception. Then afterwards, the therapist, based on whatever they feel their professional strategy is, goes in, manipulates tissue, the soft tissue work, 
join articulation mobilizations, whatever it is they feel like for the day. But every single patient in here starts with at least 10 to 15 minutes of magnet therapy, again, so we can get an edge in tissue quality. Thank you for your time.